Scant details accompanied this vintage 35mm movie footage showing a mass launch of consolidated PBY Catalina flying boats. One clue is the title card in the film that proclaims VP-6 Rendezvous over San Diego and heads for Pearl Harbor, TH. That's the territory of Hawaii decades before statehood. Delving into Catalina history, Navy Squadron VP-6 received PBY-1s starting in 1936. By January 1937, the squadron had its allotment of Catalinas, and Squadron Commander William H. McDade trained his group in anticipation of a mass overwater deployment. On 28 January 1937, VP-6 launched its 12 new Catalinas at San Diego and formed up over nearby Point Loma. Taking advantage of the Catalina's great range, for the first time, aircraft made the long overwater trip from San Diego to Pearl Harbor. The distance of 2,553 miles was covered in 21 hours and 43 minutes. These PBYs are true flying boats, not amphibians. Their wheels are detachable beaching gear, sufficient for moving the aircraft up and down seaplane ramps and on shoreside parking aprons. As the Catalina developed, its rudder shape would evolve, bulging blisters would be added to the waste gun stations, and amphibious status would be attained with the PBY-5A variant. Catalina served around the globe in the Second World War, dropping bombs, depth charges, and torpedoes. PBY served as advance eyes in the sky for enemy fleet movements. Search and rescue became an important mission for the PBYs during the war, as downed airmen, often struggling to return to base over water after combat damage to their aircraft, welcomed the sight of a slow and reliable Catalina overhead.
I'm Fred Johnson for the Aerial Images channel. Thank you for watching and especially thank you for subscribing. We appreciate it.